Um, so areas of responsibility, that was something that we mentioned um, earlier. We had the, the bubbles shown in different people involved in different places. Essentially, when we're talking topsoils, the City of Surrey, through the ISMP and NCP process, we set the targets. We set the targets, and it's up to the developer and their consultants to find a way to meet those targets. In some cases, we have a minimum requirement, minimum depth requirement. In other cases, they'll go a little beyond that to meet some other requirement. Generally speaking, the engineering department deals with everything up to the property line. Beyond the property line, it's dealt with by the building department. That's in the city of Surrey. Now, when the building department gets involved, they tend to deal with the building. They don't deal with landscaping. So we knew we had to deal with that issue. How do we ensure that there's, there's compliance within the private property? Because a lot of the topsoil will end up being on private property, whether it's multifamily sites, institutional sites, or single family sites. In some cases, we've asked the engineer of record to confirm that's the case, that the topsoil is in place. We've also, we also expect the engineer of record on a given project to highlight issues if they see that the, um, the works are not being implemented as planned. Because a lot of the work downstream is dependent on the upstream works being in place. 